I'm on fire. Okay, I just found myself listening to Comfort Ye My People, which is Messiah, but I've found this now. Prepare ye the way of the Lord. John the Baptist prepares the way. I will send my messenger ahead of you who will prepare your way. That's Malachi. A voice of one calling in the desert, prepare the way for the Lord, make straight paths for him. That's Isaiah. Well, I feel very strongly that we are living in the end times now. So what I'm saying is, am I a messenger saying, prepare you the way for the Lord? Well, you know, the idea is that we have our lamps filled anyway and ready. Right from day one of Christ's ascension, etc. So, sort of nothing new really. Nothing. You know, so you should be prepared. Comfort ye, my people. Uh, this is now Isaiah. It says of God, speak tenderly to Jerusalem, claim to her that her hard service has been completed, that her sin has been paid for, and that she has received from the Lord's hand double for all the sins. The voice of one calling in the desert, prepare the way for the Lord, make it straight in the wilderness a highway for our Lord. Every valley should be raised up. This is the sign I'm using this. But this is Isaiah chapter 40. Every mountain and hill made low, the rough ground shall become level, the rugged places a plain, and the glory of the Lord will be revealed, and all mankind together will see it, for the mouth of the Lord has spoken. Chapter 40, Isaiah. There's lots in it, very powerful stuff. I think I've read it in once before, in little sections, but it's a long chapter, so I won't go all the way through. <coughs> I've got it playing just now. Well. Psalm 40, funnily enough. I waited patiently for the Lord. He turned to me and heard my cry. He lifted me out of the slimy pit, out of the mud and mire. He set my feet on a rock and gave me a firm place to stand. He put a new song in my mouth, a hymn of praise to our God. Many he will see and fear and put their trust in the Lord. Blessed is the man who makes the Lord his trust, who does not look to the proud to those who turn aside to false gods. Many, O oh Lord my God, are the wonders you have done, the things you planned for us. No one can recount to you. Were I to speak and tell of them, they would be too many to declare. I don't know how that works, but I turn from Isaiah 40 to Psalm 40, just like that, I don't know. Anyway, whatever. It's a puzzle, man, but my fingers do do that sometimes. I'm on fire today. I can see it in my hands and my face. And a nice little frame here. Yeah. Suddenly I burst forth at a little sleep around about 10 o'clock. I love you, my Lord, with all my heart, soul, mind and strength. I love you, my Lord. 